Hey guys, what's up? Unrested here. I just uh, woke up. Um, been putting a lot of videos out over the last two days because uh, my wife and kids have been gone. Uh, put out three streaming videos on my new Unrested channel, Unrested Gaming, and uh, one video out on my Horror Kingdom channel uh, about an old Punky Brewster show. And uh, today I'm going to be putting out a JFAC here on my own channel. Uh, it's been too long that there hasn't been a JFAC, and I apologize for that. I know that's why you guys are part of this channel and I respect that and I will never ever get rid of that show and let's jump right into it um, of course the number one thing I, I bet you guys can probably already guess what people have been sending me Trump Japanese will watch Sony TV if US is attacked White House hopeful Donald Trump has savaged US ally Japan expressing frustration that Washington must defend the Asian nation but that if the United States is attacked Japanese can Quote unquote, sit at home and watch Sony television. The Republican nominee launched the broadside during a speech Friday in Iowa where he reprised his criticism of countries that do not pull their weight in terms of financial contributions to NATO and of countries like Japan and South Korea that receive U.S. protection. You know, we have a treaty with Japan where if Japan is attacked, we have to use the full force and might of the United States, the Trump said. If we're attacked, Japan doesn't have to do anything. They can sit at home and watch Sony television, okay? Okay. Trump added that the United States protects Japan, South Korea, Germany, Saudi Arabia, and other nations, and they don't pay anything near what it costs. <sighs> There's so many more factors going into it that, oh well. They have to pay because this isn't 40 years ago, he added. It's got to be a two-way street. Japan's alliance with Washington has been the bedrock of its defense since the end of World War II, and the country still hosts 47,000 U.S. troops. Trump stirred international concern in April by stressing that NATO member states should begin paying their fair share and that Japan and South Korea must prepare to arm themselves to deter a threat from North Korea. It could be that Japan will have to defend itself against North Korea, Trump said. You always have to be prepared to walk, Trump said, about getting allies to carry their financial weight. I don't think we'll walk. I don't think it's going to be necessary. It could be, though. And just like everything he says, I don't know, but I don't know. I've heard. I've heard some other people say it. I haven't said it, but I heard some other people say it. Is it obvious yet that I'm sick of this guy? I mean, don't get me wrong. I'm not a Hillary supporter. Hillary's a fucking criminal. Uh, but this guy's a fucking asshole. Uh, they'll sit at home and watch Sony TVs. You know what the scary part about this is? Is if you know anything about Sony, you know that nobody really buys Sony TVs. Like, their TV department isn't really holding the company together. It's PS4. Um, Sony's, like, a very rarely bought brand for TVs, even in Japan. So it means, like, he hasn't even done minor market research to make his nice little quip that he made. He's he's so dumb that a guy who's just some 37-year-old dude sitting in Japan knows more about the market and what people would buy than him, a man running for president. Now, normally I would say, well, of course I know more. I live in Japan. But if you're really going to do international stuff, you should know more than me about this country. Um, if you're going to be a president that interacts with this country, you should know more about it. This is so stupid. <laughs> First of all, one of the reasons why America likes to put the military all around the world is so they don't have to suddenly get a bunch of stuff out to these different parts of the world um, if something major breaks out. They're lucky these countries let them host these different bases around the world because then they can always have places where the army is, the military is ready to go. And it's more than just that. I mean, this is just one aspect of it I'm, I'm mentioning. This is, this is why America does this. This is why we have our military bases all around the world. I'm not saying I agree with it. I'm not saying we should have military bases all around the world. Um, I'm, I'm really pretty anti-war in general. I don't really think war is ever the solution. Um, if it were up to me, no country would have a military. <sighs> uh, we would settle everything with giant robots. But, I mean, seriously... That's the only aspect you're going to mention is that Japan won't fight for us. Well, first of all, Japan's like not even close to the same size as us. If they fight for us, do they need to fight for us with the same size army, the same size military? Like, there's so many more aspects going into this. 
second of all, we made them sign a treaty. We, America, made them sign a treaty after we defeated them in World War II that they would never take up arms again. We are the reason that they don't have an offensive military, that they only have a self-defense force. Like, fucking read some history books. I really don't want to get involved in this kind of, like, battle. Because I already know, like, I already know I'm going to get, like, the Trump fanboys in my comments flaming me like crazy. And, I, you know, I really don't care. I really don't care. Um, you know, and if someone, if you decide to unsubscribe because I don't like Trump, fine. I'm sure there would have been something we would eventually have disagreed on anyway. It's been real. See ya. Have a good one. Um, but I don't, I mean, I just don't like any of the candidates. I don't like politicians. This is, if this is an example of what a politician is this day, then they are dumb, ignorant. They haven't learned much in their life, it appears. Um, they can just make vague accusations and not even have an, a sense of market research or international research and, and just make statements and say that that's, that's it. That's my statement. It's, it's the truth. Nothing to back it up. No sources. Uh, what happened? Why is America like this now? I mean, don't get me wrong. Japan's politicians are a bunch of assholes, too. I don't trust any of them. We just had the guy we had to kick off the Olympics because he was stealing every little last penny for himself and his family to go eat nice dinners and buy cars. <sighs> I don't know, man. It seems like really hopeless. Anyway, those are my uh, two cents, my shiny, shiny two cents um, on this subject. Um, if I offended you, I don't know, grow up. <laughs> it's politics. Politics and religion are going to anger everybody. Um, I hope we can agree to disagree and you can continue to watch my channel. Um, if you really unsubscribe because of this video, then so be it. I've, I've done my best to stay out of this whole feud between these two parties and can it, all the different candidates, really. I, I've never taken sides with... I've never liked anybody who's been running. You know, even back when people were telling me, you gotta at least think about Bernie. No, I don't. He's an asshole, too. Oh, well. Sorry, guys. A little bit of anger in that one. Uh, just woke up, so maybe I'm a little bit grumpy, a little bit groggy. Anyway, guys, uh, thank you so much for tuning in to Unrest It, JFAC. I'm Unrest It with the questions you requested. If you'd like to check out some of my gaming, check out Unrest It Gaming. That's the name of the channel. If you'd like to hear more about my horror stories or horror stories from Japan or creepypastas from Japan, check out Horror Kingdom. Until next time, please like, comment, and subscribe.